Mary Sweetser, Squim, Washington. So here we go. Marcel just turned his helmet in after a couple track sessions. So what we're going to do is demonstrate the KPC system, which is an aircraft system, and it's being adapted to motorsports here. So Marcel turned his helmet in, the Schubert. So we're going to clean the windscreen. So we've got two products here. This is a mil spec, military specification, plastic cleaner have a military specification flannel cloth not a microfiber but a flannel cloth there you go so what we're gonna do is when Marcel came in he's got bug splatters and butterfly splatters here at the ridge we're gonna go ahead and apply the product and we're gonna let it sit there and it's gonna dwell and while it's dwelling it's rehydrating the bug carcasses and all the debris on his helmet and face shield we want, to, we want to do that because it protects the optics of the shield, just like we do on the airplanes. So we take the cloth, and we're going to usually use a two-cloth system. You've got two cloths in here. Okay. We're yeah. going to go ahead, and we're going to use that to lift the debris off and clean everything off the face shield. And it's going to feel a little damp and wet. So he's got a little bit of crazing going in here, which I'm not going to be able to get rid of. Oh yeah, lots of uh, lots of rocks been thrown at that helmet. There you go. <laughs> All so, that rider training, right? So what he's doing <laughs> is when he's with the rider training and he's behind somebody, he's instructing. He's getting he's getting the splay coming off the vehicle in front of him or the the tires in front of him. They're picking they're picking up debris and he's yeah, picking rubber, it up on rocks, his helmet. grime. So. That first cleaning came out pretty well. So what I'm going to do? I want to do the whole helmet now. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to we're going to do the helmet, but for this time, we're going to do the windscreen again or his face shield. I'm going to change cloths. So whenever we clean, we do it longitudinally. We do it in the direction of the helmet. The reason why we do that is if you do anything where you get little micro, micro scratches, you don't want to cause a haloing effect when the sun loading changes on the helmet. So we're going to go ahead and clean, switch to a, to a dry section of the cloth, clean it longitudinally, and then on the KPC system, when the cloth goes fast and quick, everything's, everything's done. And there you have it. Nice. So the optics are back. And Camera lenses too. Helmet. I'm always having getting bugs off of here. So yep. Yep. everything Absolutely. to the front of the bike you're saying as well. Yep. So what we're going to do is like on the windscreens of the bike, we can go over the BMW and it's basically the same principle. You want to protect the asset by not scratching it. Yeah, and we all know windscreens scratch super easy from yeah, cleaning. So we'll, we'll go over. You want to do a windscreen, Marcel? Well, if you want to meet me in my pit a little later, yeah. that would work. Okay, so we're going to go over to Marcel's windscreen, so there'll probably be another section in there, and we'll go over windscreens and painted fairings with this product system. Okay. And we'll do a camera lens. All right, so you do you do, do paint as well with this product? Absolutely. Awesome. Absolutely. All right, okay. pause. Okay. There to lift off all the... Burgers. So that's the pin lock, the Schubert pin lock, right? So it creates uh, an air gap so uh, I don't fog up. Breathing really hard, following my students. <laughs> Pretty much as I chat. <laughs> are you talking to them, Marcel? Oh, yeah, that's what these helmets are for. Yeah, I run them because it has the built in uh, Bluetooth right into the, into oh my the system. God. I didn't know it had that. Okay, so this came out really well. So the inside of his face shield uh, cleaned just beautifully. So yeah. we got in the future, that... I'll remove that pin lock when I'm at home and do it. Uh, get underneath the pin lock okay. too. So that's it, guys. So when you're doing this, just remember microfibers are a little bit tough on your optics. Uh, they can scratch if they've been through the dryer. These military flannel spec cloths won't scratch, and they can be laundered and reused again. Nice. And then you dedicate it to the bike. All right. Dedicate it to your equipment. Okay. All right, and we're in my pit. Okay, so what we've done is we left the KPC pit. We've come down to Marcel's pit. And he's asked to have his fairing paint work cleaned. 
and he's asked to get the bug hits off of his windscreen. So we're going to basically apply the same principle we do to the aircraft. These bug hits have been on there. The bug carcasses have dried. They're adhered to his windscreen. We don't want to remove those in a way that they're not hydrated to scratch the, scratch the optics and the plastic. So what I do is I've got bulk KPC canopy and windscreen cleaner here. I'm going to liberally spray this again and let the product soak and dwell the bug hits. Now you can use the pinky effect and if you've got some real bug, you know, nasty bugs that have been on there for a week, as if you had did not post flight your bike yeah. and clean it. So we're going to let that dwell on there just like that. Make sure all the bug hits are hydrated. So that's done. That's about long enough. So again, this is the F2 cloth. This is the flannel. It's mill spec. We take that and I'm going to take one cloth and just clean the impact debris off of there without putting a lot of pressure on so that I don't drive in any anything into the plastic and accidentally scratch it. What I'm doing here also is because I am really prudent on what the operators, when you guys are riding, that you have good optics through here. When you clean and you do circular motions on that if you have any micro debris on there you're going to get scratching that could cause uh, crazing later on so I always clean in a longitudinal manner front to back on the motorcycle so that we don't get any scratching so yeah again, most people don't uh, realize or think about that at yeah. all it's a good so little a advice so I'm going to re rehydrate again. Yeah, we got some. That's probably some track rubber from the guy in front of me. Yeah. So with the rubber splay coming off the guy in front of you, the KPC will eventually break it down, but it takes time. So again, I'm going to clean for him. Make sure all the bug hits from what Monday, Marcel? Um, no, um, just from today. Okay. I had everything. The whole bike, there was a bike wash video actually uh, where I washed the whole bike on, uh, what was it, on Tuesday. Okay, so that's just the general clean that I've done. You see that, and I'm going to the second cloth. And when you feel the cloth go slick, oh, yeah, the KPC nice. product, you can, you're, you're done. Go slick, you're done. So also your instrument clusters, all the plastics, your timers, everything else, I want you guys to clean that the same way. Oh yeah, that's right, lap timer, instrument, yeah. Yeah, anything like that with a plastic screen so you don't compromise it and you get the best cleaning and then you get the most life out of the product. So now we're going to go to the painted surface on his fairing and this is, which bike is this? This is Merlin, my 2016 S1000. Okay, so this is Merlin. So on his fairing and stickers, all I'm going to do is again, I'm trying not to scratch. I want to remove the bug debris in the display from his sessions off the paint. There was one good bug hit over here, butterfly side. Clean that. There you go. Awesome. Well, thanks for coming over my pit. And yep. Yeah. And if you, I think Marcel's had a pretty good training session. So if you're doing any track time days with him, he'd be able to coach you through that. So you have optimum use of your asset and enjoy your track time. So That's right. Uh, there's Powell's bike. So we've had a little morning so far. And uh, you've been enjoying the live commentary as you're riding around the track on that little 600? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Full throttle in the turn one, right? <laughs> <laughs> soon, soon. That'll be the next step. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Thanks, Marcel. Appreciate it. All right. Well, thank you for uh, coming over and supporting the sport. And I'm looking forward to trying your other products in the future, the vinyl cleaner and leather cleaner. And this is, of course, what we're using right now. And then uh, there's a shampoo for the RV. You got it. Anyways guys, my name is Marcella Ernie. Thanks for tuning in. Cheers.